warning others tonight to secure their doors. After a burglar went through their homes while they were sleeping, the bold thief struck houses on Southwest 16th in the Cooper Mountain area. Our Jennifer Dowling has the details on how they got in. Jen? Good evening. Yeah, those thieves appeared to be going house to house, checking the doors and taking small items and quick cash, all while residents were still inside. They came up through here, saw this, came through here. Jeff Rouse says it was around 5.45 a.m. when his security system started going off. Basically, I'd heard the, the beep upstairs um, that the door had opened. Jeff says someone had unscrewed his outdoor light bulbs. So they jumped up on here and they actually untwisted that. And entered the only unlocked door at the home, leading to what he calls his man cave. You know, you don't expect to... Uh, feel like you're not safe in your own house. So as thieves were downstairs taking his change jar and about $100 in cash. And then I noticed this drawer was kind of open like that. He was upstairs checking on his family. When he realized it was a stranger tripping the alarm, they were gone. And then I know they came in three times and out three times. Deputies say they also tried to get into Sue Dercoop's house. Her screen door had been opened and her security lights disabled. I feel violated. I really do. She says they were not able to break in there, but deputies say at around 6 o'clock, they broke into a sliding glass door at yet another neighbor's house, stealing a purse, credit cards, car keys, and more. Her gifts were all stolen, yes, and thank goodness she hadn't put the big ticket item gifts underneath the tree yet. Jeff is just glad his daughter is safe. That's, that's, that's really what this is all about. I mean, that's the thing that really um, kind of shook me the most is, you know, her safety. And Jeff says for his part, he'll be installing new security cameras around his house to try to catch anyone who might break in on camera. He also advises that you check your doors before you go to bed. Make sure they are all locked. Also, he suggests getting your own security system because you never know. Back to you. You never know. You can never be too safe nowadays. Thanks, Jennifer.